Hello Aries, welcome to my channel. This will be a reading for the week of the 14th of March. Uh, please bear in mind that these are general readings so it may not resonate for everybody. So do take what does and leave what doesn't. If you do like the reading, please do like, share and subscribe and hit the notification bell. That would be very helpful and I would very much appreciate that. Okay, so for this week Aries, we have um, the divination of water, using water known as laconomancy, which I actually did uh, this a few weeks back um, and I used water with um, food coloring and olive oil. This time around, instead of the olive oil, I'll be using pebbles, which is also um, uh, also a, a tradition with laconomancy. So, you know, it's just another way of doing it, but I'll still be using the, um, the food coloring here. That's kind of my own twist there. And of course, I'll be pulling out some cards as well towards the end. I have my Hawaiian cards here. Okay, Aries, let us begin, let us begin. Okay. Okay, this is a reading for Aries. You have a strong vision. It's almost like some of you are, are, are seers or visionaries. That's how strong your visions can be. It's, it's like you are able to tap into your higher self here that's a lot stronger than it ever has been. You know, you're you're in a you're in a very good phase here where you're able to picture something in your mind and really make that happen for yourself. It's a very strong period for you, Aries. I see as someone close to you that has a great understanding of uh, the things that you go through and what you're going through and trying to find trying to find something within you uh, that connects to your everyday life, if that makes sense. There's somebody around you that has deep appreciation and respect for you and how you, you um, go about things and how you see the world. That gives you a lot of peace. I do see a lot of peace around you. And even though it, there's a lot of peace, it's still very lively. So I feel like the peace actually brings you that liveliness, you know, because you're able to relax, but also have fun at the same time. Um, it's very harmonious for you this coming week. Very, very, there's a lot of harmony here. Things, um, I, so what I see here, there's, if you've been in a certain pattern, in a certain cycle that you haven't felt so comfortable with, that's coming to an end. So bad habits are coming to an end. Certain you know, bad patterns or whatnot, that's coming to a finish. You're able to um, grasp what it is that hasn't been good for you, take full control of it. Yeah, and that, that's leading you to a whole other space in your head, in your mind. There's such a growth and development here of the self, Aries. And a deep appreciation. I guess this seems like a lot of gratitude coming into play here. Um, oh, yeah. There's a helping hand. There is a helping hand. It may come very unexpectedly. Someone may be reaching out and you didn't expect them to come at, at the most perfect time for you. It's like synchronicity almost. There's like a, a, a certain number of events that have led up to uh, this moment coming in contact with this person that can really uh, help you open some doors perhaps. There's just something that's going to be uh, very... Um, an, an opening, very, it's, it's very honest, very, it's a very honest approach to how you do things. And I do see honesty is a big thing here as well. 
good communication and perhaps, you know, um, even if it's criticism towards po po probably a work that you're doing or project that you're doing, um, it's good for you. Definitely uh, another person coming in here that truly cares for you. Very, very helpful for you. And I do see that it's kind of unexpected. Perhaps they come in um, and give you some sort of advice that gives you a, a big awakening or, you know, um, another way of seeing something. But it's like you're really going somewhere. I do see some of you planning to go away also um, because you are left with um, an, an achievement that's allowed you to be flexible, if that makes sense for some of you. I'm going to be now throwing in some pebbles. See how the water reacts. Something is arising in terms of your finances here. It's positive. It is, there's a steadiness here. You may, you may find some unexpected expenses, but it's okay. You will get past that. You just have to, it's saying here to just be wise about certain investments and to invest wisely for some of you, if that's the case. Something to do with property as well. Uh, you want to establish like your own home, everything about it. You want to feel like it is your own. Um, and also children. Children, you know, the there's something that, you, you know, you're looking after so, uh, something, I mean, children, but also it could be pets. There's just something there where um, the pets or the children very, very near and dear to you. Um, and there's something here, Aries, that you find to be quite cosmic, if that makes sense. That's what I'm seeing here, something very cosmic. I feel like something is going to come about where uh, mysteries are being revealed and it all happens in what feels like strange timings, some things that you are just unable to explain. So I hope that makes sense to some of you. I see some of you also um, getting very busy, very, very busy with work um, and there seems to be, because you, you're going to be so busy, there may be a slight lack in the emotional department with somebody else if you are in a relationship. But again, I know I mentioned the understanding before, so you know that does come into play, and it is very, very helpful for you also. Um, there's an opportunity arising. There's an opportunity that may take you onto a different path, but I, I see here you're going to really kind of hold on to it. You're going to reach out and it's like, yeah, I'm going to try it. You're taking certain risks, Aries. You're taking certain risks here, um, but it, it feels very fulfilling for you. Very fulfilling. There are certain things that you can't necessarily explain because of, of, of the kind of chain of... Uh, situations that happen, if, if that makes sense. But you're going to be happy with it because it's like it all falls into place really, really nicely. Pieces of the puzzle are all go going to be put together as well. A lot of harmony, Aries. This is a very positive reading. Honestly, it's very, very harmonious. You know, busy, but in harmony. <laughs> so get ready to, to work on a, no a number of really exciting projects um, and I do feel here, you know, uh, establishing certain connections uh, will come into focus as well. But this, this will be um, a continuous connection. It's just sort of almost the beginning of it for some of you. And um, talks of um, planning your next steps in terms of what you want in a relationship, it kind of comes into your mind a lot. But, you know, lively, busy, uh, but in peace as well. Okay, let's see what the cards have for you, Aries. All right. 
Queen of Cups, the Five of Sticks, the Six of Sticks. Yes. So you see, this is actually exactly what I said. The Queen of Cups is this beautiful, um, you know, that, that harmony, that love that you have around you, um, but with offers as well. There's something and somebody reaching out to you. You find yourself, um, we're here with the Five of Sticks, very busy, you know, feeling like you're competing almost, but it's healthy competition. There is a difference. This is healthy competition. Um, and I see you stacking things up, stacking things together, preparing for something, possibly your move. But here with the six of sticks, which is like the six of wands, gives you great success here with the six of sticks. Um, you know, you're getting recognized, so you're getting a good, basically a yes answer towards something here. The warrior of cups. And the boy of sticks. So this is like the Knight of Cups here, and this is the Page of Wands. Isn't this wonderful? Here with the Knight of Cups, this is somebody coming to assist you with something. There is definitely some special connection coming in. Not necessarily love connection, though. There's something else coming in. Someone sees how, um, you know, how much uh, you, can, you can give to something that is important um, in terms of what you do um, and I see that they are inspired by a certain work ethic that you have and your vision you have great vision you know and this may come in here with the boy of sticks as something perhaps that you never thought of before you didn't quite think of it in that way but it's it's prosperous it's look at that we have the ace of oh wow it's exactly what i said oh aries i'm loving this for you ace of six basically the ace of ones yes sir. this is a big fat yes for you this is uh something of a of a new beginning there is a transformation here happening trust in your visions also i have to say dreams. You may find yourself dreaming a lot um, and maybe note down those dreams. There's some, some link there. There's a connection between your dreams and, and what you're living out as well. Um, you know, perhaps pay attention to that, but there's something within you. You have a vision. You see it. Even though it may come in as a surprise, you, you'll then have some kind of understanding of it all. Only you can understand that, you know, um, of how things have come together. It's so wonderful. This is like uh, a really great opportunity coming in for you. And it, there's love and compassion and warmth here as well. Um, but th there's, there's something beautiful here that's being created. Something is really in the process of um, something big and beautiful coming in. You can't go wrong with this. I love this for you, Aries. Oh, I hope that this resonated. I hope it helped in some way and that you enjoyed this reading. Thank you all so much for your support. I truly appreciate it. Aries, until next time, thank you all.